Take one. Action. All right, so peace, everyone. Um, my honors class, my A3-4 um, class, decided to do a video for you all. I know as teachers, uh, we have a very thankless job. We don't get the appreciation. We don't get the love at times that we need. Uh, some days it's very hard to wake up and come and teach the amount of students that we teach, but we still do it because we honestly love our leaders here. So um, just take this in. Um, just know that the students genuinely meant this. This is all um, their work. I didn't tell them to say any, any of this stuff. Um, so yeah, just this is just a video to show our appreciation to you all. Enjoy. My name is James Ambrose. My name is Jonathan Cabrazale. My name is Rachel Stark. I'm Samuel Hawkins. I'm Paula Singleton. My name is Kamaya, and I'm in Lake Jimmy City Advisor. Hello, my name is Janelle Blackwood, and I am from the Loretta Lynch Advisory. My name is Tariel Horton, and I'm a senior at Bella College Prep. I'm Marcus Moore, I'm a senior at Bella College Prep. My name is Peggy Bryant. Hey, my name is Patricia, and we're thankful for. I appreciate is Miss Alexander and Miss Fields. I'm thankful for Miss Underwood. And we appreciate you, Jasmine. The person we are doing today is Mrs. Barnett. We are thankful. The person I will be doing today is Mr. Jefferson. Miss Taylor, aka Miss Tay Tay. Taylor. Taylor. Ah. <laughs> oh, my name is Sammy Hawkins, and I'm thankful for Miss Gilman. My name is Tariel, and I'm thankful Miss Trans. My name's Paula, and I'm thankful for Ms. Trash and Ms. Calvin. My name is Rayshawn, and I'm thankful for Ms. Trash. This video is about Mr. Burnett and Ms. Branch. And we're thankful to all the teachers who taught us, and some who just motivated us. So I appreciate Mr. Burnett because I look at Mr. Burnett as a father figure. Um, it's like, it's a, a lot of times me and Mr. Burnett had conversations in he like helped me um, grow and understand the reasons why boys, young boys do, do do the things that they do and what to look forward to in the future. Um, I appreciate Miss Underwood because last year when I came to Butler, um, she became like a second mother to me when she had, she like pushed me to do better last year because last year wasn't a good year. And with Miss Alexander. I appreciate her because she helped me become a self-dedicated person to know that if anything, if I want to get anything done, I can always do it on myself and to always love myself. Uh, Mr. Jefferson, he listens. Like when I like got a lot on my chest and stuff, I need to get off. He listens. Um, he's good with giving advice. I appreciate that he motivated me on days I wasn't really feeling it, not really feeling like doing this work or work at all. I appreciate Miss Chad because. When you just need somebody to talk to her, when you just got problems, you gonna just always go to her. I appreciate Miss Taylor because every day I come to your class and I ask you for a break. Because I need a break. Lord knows I need a break. And <laughs> you uh, you a real understanding teacher. Like, you cool. And, like, every teacher I ever known, but you real open when it comes to stuff. Like, you be giving us, even though we might take it as a joke and you might take it as a joke, you be giving us life lessons. When it comes like certain stuff, we ain't gonna talk about it, but you know. Uh, I appreciate Ms. Gomez because, like, even though she wasn't with me all four years, she's with me for uh, like these past three years, and like she's shown that she actually cares about me, like as a teacher who who's not in the same race as me, but she understands a lot and like went through and goes through the same things that I do. So like that shows me that like that's real love. You feel me? So yeah. When our old advisor left, she came and she took us in, even though she didn't even have to. I appreciate J. Rob because when I first met Ms. Robson, I didn't like her. She came in trying to change things, but later on, I understood like what she was doing, and she she wasn't changing our advisor for like we could be best friends, or she was changing us for like we had to talk every day. She was um trying to make she was trying to shape us into becoming young ladies and having girls as your friend without it being drama or y'all getting into it and stuff like that. 
and she gave us an outside, uh, outside support system other than our family. Mr. Sims helped me with um, not procrastinating when it comes to like his classwork and his homework. He helped me with typing, with typing files. Um, <laughs> that's been a biggest struggle for me, but I know I'm getting there. He's helping me a lot with that. Rockstar Miss Trash, something that she helped me with. She helped me with like my mindset thoughts of me like just, just Miss Trash basically helped me with like my thoughts of things, like how I could go about things. So if I feel like I'm stuck in a moment where no one's gonna listen to me or no like no one's gonna understand, Nine times out of ten, Miss Traz been through it, and she understand what we talking about. So she actually could give you good advice, so she can, put, like, help you perform like a better outcome with the situation that you're going. through. Miss Taylor helped me with a lot. Um, that's why I look at her as a mother figure. Um, she helped me with stuff outside of school and school, and I appreciate her for that. These teachers have helped me grow and develop myself into a young, mature man. Like when I came here. I thought I was mature, but I wasn't because I was still going off on teachers and everything, like my F area. But now that I could bite my tongue and just relax myself on my own. I will thank you. Thankful for you in general, Miss Robinson. I love you. <laughs> I'm thankful for you, Ms. Robinson, because you became a second mother to me. You listened to every problem I ever had and became a show that I can come to and cry on even if you cried too. I'm very thankful for you, Ms. Robinson. I'm glad you took over our advisory. I love you and I can't wait to see y'all bond grow, continue to grow because it became unbreakable. <laughs> we love you, Ms. Robinson. We thankful for you. Yeah. I am thankful that she came into my life as and my advisor because I think I wouldn't be where I would be at this year with my grades and stuff if it wasn't for her. And um, last year I didn't have a role model, but this year I think she my role model because she a positive person in my life and she had a positive impact. I'm thankful for Miss Alexander giving me her patience, her time, and her blessed warm heart with the whole college situation because I know it's stressful having like different caseloads of kids and stuff. So I appreciate her with just being there for me and stuff. And when it feels, I thank her for just being a second mother to me when I feel like I don't have no one or no one to come to. I know that she's always there with like listening ears and always giving me advice and telling me how to go about things. I'm thankful for Mr. Burnett because He's very understanding. He has an open mind when it comes to our success and black excellence. And I appreciate him because it's just it's just warm to have another father figure in our life who actually care about us and motivate us in the school. And I'm thankful for Miss Branch because she just she's just the best. She's just oh I don't even know what to say. Cause she's just she's just everything to me. She cool, she funny, she when we need her for anything. She'll give it to us by any necessary. She's just a dope advisor. I'm thankful for him. Uh, just being there guiding me to be a better person. Help me open up my shell. I'm just thankful for the, like, that I can have an older person that I can call like a second mom. Like, uh, yeah, so yeah. That's really I love her, man. Aww. Thank you, Ms. Bill, man. Um, I'm very thankful that you keep it real with us. Yep. Um, you or remind us that. every day that um, you remind us every day who you do it for, and that that helps me to remind myself who I'm doing it for. So yeah, you keep it real with us, and I really am thankful for that because some teachers, I mean, not some teachers, but a lot of people don't know how they don't they they not comfortable with keeping it a hundred. Girl, give me some black skin. I'm just thankful that Miss Trask is actually in my life, and without her. I know I have my advisors and stuff, but it's like a different type of understanding that Ms. Trask has that we both have together. And I'm just thankful that God put her in my life for a reason. Um, I'm thankful for Ms. Trask and Ms. Calvin because without the talks we had, I won't be the changed younger daughter I am today. Um, Y'all taught me in order to see a change, I have to, I have to change. Um, I'm thankful to have your support because I don't receive it at home. So having, having your Having you guys support matters to me. Uh, aside of Miss Calvin being a lady that's there for me to help me with struggles and problems or uh, life in general, Miss Trask is a person that I can count on to and bullet and that I trust. Thank you, Miss Trask. Thanks, Miss Trask. Thanks, guys.
cut. Thank you, Mr. Burnett, because, you know, he's like one of the realest people I know, like one of the realest men I know in my life right now. Like I put him like in the tops with my dad because you feel me? If I ever need to talk to him about anything, I can come talk to him, which I'm gonna actually start doing more. And like even with like like getting DJ equipment or like even just like talking about promoting DJ and like he always, you know, yo, always there for me. Like, it's like a big brother slash pops. One, two, three. Thank, Thank you, Mr. Mr. Barnett. I'm thankful for Milky, Mr. Milky, giving Mr. Goins this school and the butlers donating money to make our school great. I'm thankful for butlers just being here on 821 East 103rd Street. Just thankful for all you guys. Thank you, all these teachers. <laughs> we love y'all, even if we argued with y'all before. And Cut. kicked us out of class. Cut. And gave us the merits. Cut! <laughs> <laughs>